Hello, and I'm going to show you how you can create an auto exec file in CS2. So with this, you can choose certain types of command that CSGO will automatically run when you start it up. So in that way, you can, for example, bind your crouch jump button to something. Now, let's just get started. So start by going to your Steam and make sure that your CS2 is closed. Right click on your CS2, go to manage and then go to browse local files. And when we're in this, we're going to go ahead and click on game. Click on game, then we're going to open CSGO, open CSGO, and then we're going to open CFG. And what we're now going to do is make sure that you see the .cfg files. So go to your view and then enable this hidden file name extensions, enable that file name extensions. So yeah, now you see what type of file it is. And then we're going to create our own auto exec file. So right click on something, go to new and click text document. And right now rename the text document and then type something like autoexec.cfg. Make sure that you have .cfg because otherwise it will not work. So remove the .txt and paste in that. Then press on enter, click on yes, I want to change it. And now it will change to a cfg file. Now right click on it, go to open with. And then either open it with Notepad or any other software that you would use for this. So I recommend just using Notepad. And then you'll see like this. So right here you can type in your CSGO commands that you want to exec. Now in my case I'm just going to put in my crouch jump bind. So when you typed in everything that you want, go to file and go to save. Make sure it's saved correctly and in a good location. If you've done that all very good, then close down your file explorer. Then go to CSGO, go to properties, go to general, and then scroll down and right here you should see launch options. And right here type plus exec and then auto exec.cfg. So type plus exec and then your file name.cfg. So once you've done that, we can now close this down and play cs2 click on play when you open your uh, console if the execution didn't work then it will show up errors right here now let's say that your execution didn't work you can always type exec and then type auto exec dot cfg and if you do this it will now execute the file but when you put it in your launch option options, it will automatically do this. So you have nothing to worry about. Now, if this has helped you, then I'd say thank you for watching. Please consider liking and subscribing. See you next time.